for a long time, it was impossible to make serious indigenous British films within the film industry. And all of us that made films, who were lucky enough to make films at all, did so for television for a long stretch of time from the um, really the late 60s through to the early 80s. I mean, everybody from Ken Loach downwards, uh, we, we all, the voice was television. Uh, and in fact, we used to sit around saying, you know, we don't, the world out there, the rest of the world, in world cinema, including in the States, think that there's no British filmmaking. And in fact, we, we'd say, you know, it, there's a really strong film culture here, alive and well, but hiding in television. And we used to say to the BBC, you know, why can't we make these films on 35 millimeter and give them a theatrical release and then show them on television? And they said, no, oh, no, you can't do that because this, that, and the other reason, the unions and all sorts of uh, excuses. And then guys from the BBC, headed by Jeremy Isaacs, started Channel 4. And Channel 4's remit was let's make television films, but let's make them as theatrical films, put them out internationally and show them on television. And that's what happened. And with producer Graham Benson, he and I went along to Channel 4. We said, can we do it as a feature film? In other words, on 35 millimeter, and not just as a telefilm. And he said, if this was next year, you'd be able to, but we're not quite there yet. So it was made, it was, I say the third film that was made as a telefilm on 16 millimeter. Had it been made as a feature film, meantime, I think history would have been quite different. It, it, it was shown on television, on, on Channel 4, I think a couple of times. It was shown and then it sank without trace. But there were lots of bootleg copies kicking around, recorded off air. There was no, uh, you couldn't buy it in the shops or anything. And I used to receive letters on a regular basis from people who would say, I'm unemployed, I've seen this film, I've got a copy of this film in the meantime, and it's a lifeline, and it's great, and I thank you, and all that, you know. And it went on for years. And eventually, it started to, we started to find ways of um, getting it out there.